Hello everyone, sorry here uh, Today we are going to play Daybreak Leona Diana deck This is an old archetype that kind of died off after a lot of nerfs But now we have two new cards to this archetype We have General of the Dunes Which lets you put vulnerable on the opponent's units every time you activate Daybreak So this is extremely useful Because you're playing a mid-range deck capable of pulling things You, can, you have a lot of buffy units so being able to put vulnerable and killing those units your opponent's units is very useful for you to win the board uh, another new card is the value card the general uh, herald of celestial convergence what this does is once you have let's say you have a couple of daybreak units on the board or nightfall units like the winding light which is also another win condition uh, this will reactivate all of them if you activate its daybreak you're getting overwhelmed if you get get nightfall you're play, getting spell shield now overwhelm is usually the best because you want to push extra damage but spell shield is also not too bad uh but yeah it lets you reactivate the daybreak for example if we have something like a leona or a solar sunhawk now you're double stunning the opponent's units and you're setting up for a really strong attack in your attack turn and potentially ending the game on the spot uh we also have ravon to get access to daybreak multiple times a turn and put more pressure this thing can get really buffy and becomes a problem if, and if winding light gives it over it can end the game we will take this to ladder and we'll see how it goes without further ado here we go all right we're against elusive team which is quite popular i think i want to keep this uh i one person i think on america server already hit masters with, with this deck so a lot of people are are jamming it right now uh might be just a pass for me here like i don't really gain too much by playing this uh, i'm down to play it now though yeah now we play it attack push three damage kind of put some pressure next time we can go sun guardian into into the big guy and then we start to doing the vulnerable stuff right all right just pass they could have a weapon or something oh no they don't have weapons never mind it's just it's literally just pure swarm elusive units into burn damage right and the problem is we don't really have answers for the burn like i don't have healing and stuff so i'm gonna have to kind of survive early on uh kind of preserve next itself try to pick off their unit and from there maybe we can uh, end the game with the big guy before we die and we're attacking on even so that's kind of good so i can play him on turn eight and hopefully i can end the game all right we can jump this now can pull this away uh i think everything swings i pulled this here and everything swings so we can keep this pressure on them Forcing them into blocking, right? I'm still taking 4 damage from these and potentially more if they have more units. Uh, next turn, though, if they do play a unit, I can go Leona and stun something. Slow them down a tiny bit. I will see if it works out. For next turn, right? Yeah. So everything gets buffed here. I can block the other unit, but the rest will push. We push some good damage here. Especially if he got yeah, another elusive. So this could be even an open attack here. Uh, six, seven, eight damage face. So that's kind of painful. Ooh, can't do anything. I don't have a hush or anything either. Alright, let's go Ravon. Ah, uh, maybe I should have went this instead of Ravon. Uh, I guess that's fine. Oh yeah, now we just need to survive the burn. But the thing is, blowback plus get excited plus something is lethal technically. And this might be looking for that burn. Also, some of their elusive units might hit us next time. I do have stuns, but we'll see how they work. Why now? Why not wait on? Not too sure. Oh! All right, we got hush. We got hush. I'll try to pull everything here, because I can still play this and daybreak it, right? The forest hides 
Recall. Is it recall or stun? Recall. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Alright, let me do uh, this. I can play Leona next turn if I have to. Alright, so now the boom pulls. Now, Ravu pulls this, you pull this, here, here, and you pull this. Right, right, kill everything, uh, not, don't allow any elusives to go through, and we still have uh, this for next turn, right, so we don't get any elusive damage. And on the upcoming turn, hopefully I can set up a lethal. It's just I need I really need this Leon on the board. That's kind of the problem, right? Winding light is okay. The problem is if I play Leona, I won't be able to shut down any other elusive units. So that kind of sucks. Yeah. So I have to pass, I guess. Play this to stun. Oh, we're stunning here always, I forgot. My bad. So I'm taking one damage here, so we drop down to six. Technically. And they lose their blockers. I could... Yeah. I always silence this, I ignore this. Look here. Uh, okay, anything survive? Yeah, we take two damage here, unfortunately, so we're down to five. Now any burn is kind of lethal here. So it could be winding light, it could be this guy. I feel like winding light is just straight up better, right? So let's fail. Into a big guy. And we're hoping they don't have the burn. Blowback plus Mystic Shot is lethal. Get excited plus Mystic Shot. So like two stuff. Double blowback maybe. Oh, that is mana they're spending here. Uh, let's pull these on the overwhelm units so they take overwhelm damage. And we have lethal here. They need blowback. No, not enough. Get excited Mystic Shot. No other out. Get excited Mystic Shot. That's one. That's two. It could be double Mystic. It is double Mystic. Wait, do. I do I not have lethal? I don't have lethal. Okay, the game goes on. We're not safe now. But they, they used up all of their burn. On, like, not all. They could still have a blowback in their hand or something, right? So, uh, I wish I had anything. Like, guiding touch, we would be chilling. Oh, elusive unit. This will drop me down to four. I can't block it. I could stun it next turn. That's whatever. Ah, that's fine, that's okay. That's okay. Alright, let's stun one of their units here. Uh, yeah, you can go. So we don't take two damage here. I don't know what this is. But, whatever it is, if it's not a Wuju style, we're chilling. Yeah, it's not a Wuju style. Okay. We're chilling, we're chilling. Uh, Leona? Leona. And next turn, if I open attack, I have lethal on the open, but I could also play this. But it doesn't matter, right? Like, they don't really have any slow speed burn. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I should just always jam this to, like, make sure we win. And we're at four, so there isn't any threat. What is this? A stick shot, maybe? Oh, what is this? Oh, they run in the main docket. Sheesh. Wait, I don't have lethal anymore, technically. Oh, uh, no, I, I do have lethal in the open. It's just we don't know what they have in the. Like, burn wise. If they get to get excited, it's unplayable, so that's good for us. But if they get a blowback or a mystic shot, I lose. I lose on the spot. 
Yeah, no healing or anything. Slam the big guy. Activate everything. Stun all of their units. And we go face. And now we're hoping this isn't a blowback or a mystic shot. It can be a Gatic Sided, it's whatever. It can be a unit, it's whatever. Oh, it could have been it could be another one of these. But they do they actually run two of them? Or a shock blast. Oh, I don't think oh, they actually top deck. Deny, okay, we're chilling. We're fine, we're fine. Okay, I kinda I played into stuff. I played into stuff that I probably shouldn't. If I just open attacked, one of these units was probably gonna hit face, right? Unless they run pump. Even palm isn't enough, right? I don't think even palm was enough. But I kinda played it more uh, more scary. Uh, I could have played around the shock blast and the other spell. But yeah, GG. Alright, we are up against uh, Samira Anni. So this is. Uh, I think I'm gonna full move these. Uh, I think this is a landmark. Oh, wait, the landmark is Bilgewater, isn't it? I kinda forgot. I think it's Bilgewater. The Thai Bulk. But yeah, we'll see if they play something here. Okay. So I have like options here, but they're kind of weird options, right? But I, I could pass here, but that does mean I'm gonna take more damage. I could daybreak into Diana, I guess, and work on the Leona a little bit. I could have Diana first, then Nightfall to kind of see what they do. But the problem with that play is that I'm not working on the Leona level up, right? Which is something we really want. And they could have a Samira here, which kind of sucks for us, yeah. But I still had to attack. I needed to kill that 2-1. So they can play some mirror on the upcoming turn anyways. And if I open pass, they will probably also take the pass. So it's, it was kind of... We were in trouble regardless, right? Okay. Diana is dead. I can do this and chill like this. I don't get the buffs for the upcoming turns or anything. But I work on the Leona level up. Which I think... Is very oh it is Noxus here. Yeah. Right, I was trolling. Oh this is really good. This is perfect. This is what just what we needed here. And now we can activate Nightfall on this. So now they do have to kill this thing. They probably have answers. Uh, at least we get to push some damage. Here. Seven damage face is really nice. Uh, they could have oh nothing. Okay that's perfect. Maybe they have a second Samira or something. Oh, burn. Yeah, burn incoming. Uh, I can play Ravun next turn. Into a Leona, maybe. We'll see. Oh, this is also nice. Mm. It could be this into a Diana. I think that's a bit better. And we hold on on the Ravun. I don't really need him right now. Yeah, we're getting burned here. Omega burned. And they're getting this active fast. Sheesh, that's a lot of damage. I need to pick these off fast. And they're act also activating the Raven Bloom really quick. So that's also a problem. Let's go Leona here. And I'll try to pull one of them this turn. I'll probably pull the 3-2, three, 3-1 three, maybe. Uh, I think everything wants to swing here. Yeah, everything swings. Push as, uh, as much damage as possible. Alright, so no fast speed spell, that's good, we need to take damage right now. Uh, next turn, probably Ravvon. And he is annoying. Ah, the wildfire is incoming. It's happening. The burn. Can I set up lethal next turn? No. Uh, maybe. It is a bit difficult though, but it, it could be done. I have a pale cascade, I'm just not sure if I want to block. Because of the centigrade and stuff like that, right? Uh, but I got to stun one of their units. Hmm. 
down to 10 HP. And now they're gonna play this. I am getting burned. So I don't know if I can set up the lethal here. We'll try. Hopefully. Hopefully. Before we get burned here. They have one damage in her. Two damage technically. So I'm technically at eight. But I'm double stunning here. And yeah, I can set up the lethal here. I'm pushing a lot of damage. If I don't get burned here, I'm, it, it is doable. That's fine. Go for a swing, pull this. Just, just press OK. I have fake cascade. If I need one damage, I probably don't need it. It won't come in handy. I just need this to hit face and one of. Oh, actually, I do need the pale cascade because so, this is eight. This is eight. All right. GG's, GG's. Uh, I think if we didn't end the game this turn, next turn we were probably gonna get burned down. All right, we're up against Anila Fizz. We played it yesterday. Uh, what they want to do is set up a Fizz into uh, into the Catalyst, and then they push extra damage, right? So it can be annoying for us. But for the time being, we're just passing. Uh, I don't have a one drop or a two. I mean, I had a Solaris Sanok, but I kind of removed it. Uh, I didn't really want it that much, but oh, they discarded Anila. Oh, that's interesting. Maybe they have another one, I guess. I'm not sure. Hmm. Yeah, that's not too good for me. I could sack this Diana, although I'm not very happy with it, but I could do that. Just to kind of preserve my health. But it's important for us to preserve our health. And we can go uh, big guy here, and this big guy can block the Nila. Alright, let's go big guy. And next turn I can go general of the dunes as well. What is joy to you, True joy. I could attack here, I don't think they want to block. If they want to block, I guess it's only because they want Nila to swing, maybe. Oh, card draw. Not very good for me. But she's not leveling anytime soon. We're, we're chilling for now. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna take maybe elusive damage here. But I can at least put vulnerable on him. And maybe we can pull him later. Okay. I'll block this, obviously. I don't wanna take too much damage. And now... I could go Leona here. Yeah, I'm, I'm down for Leona. Kinda kill their stuff. I need to kill this Nila as well before she levels. Alright, we'll see what they want to do. They have 5 mana, so I don't really have too much. But these are giving them that card draw, that important card draw. And she's about to level. We also know that they could also play that plus two damage card, right? That's kind of annoying. They can kill something here. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, they're gonna kill it, right? Let's take shot, most likely. Yeah. All right. So the plan is kill the Nila, kill the Fizz, ignore this for now. The only problem is if they have another Fizz. That would be a bit annoying. But yeah, let's kill like this. And then we'll figure out what Another fizz would be a bit annoying. Okay. Alright. I can't stun anything, unfortunately. This is somewhat fine. I'll obviously block here. Uh, this will mean that this could die to a lot of stuff like make it rain probably stuff like that uh it is what it is i mean we have a really strong swing next time to be fair so if i play this into a diana and next time i can do this into a widening light uh probably dead still fine i think let's do this we'll put the diana on the board 
and next turn we can do heavens uh, aligned a lot of card draw though like this deck runs card draw it wants so much card draw uh yeah. all right let's do this see what we get not what we want i was hoping maybe something like a doom beast for the healing would be really good uh interesting all right let's go for the swing i think i'll pull it here because i think they might have a mystic shot for this so i'll put it here because here is kind of more difficult to kill like even if this dies it's okay that's all right i still have this and this uh good i think they're setting up a make it train i guess I am losing resources to be fair, but the good thing is that this is busted. Where do you stand, this is very busted, right? For, for later if we want. And I don't really have a lot of fearsome blockers either. So it becomes very annoying for them to deal with. That's the card we were scared of. And that's Nina. I need to block Nila, right? So if I do this, I can't block her. It has to be this guy. It has to be this guy. And this lets me block it. I'm not too sure about that attack. I can still block here and kind of chill, I guess. Yeah, this makes more sense. the Dion now. Sure. Yeah, we're still at 10 HP, we're still pretty healthy. They don't have any units so they can't play this, so we're kind of chilling now. So what we wanna do is play this, activate Nightfall, jump these into this and buff up all these, the two Nightfall units we played. And then potentially like set up that loot. Ah, uh, it's okay. Just jump these for now. Ah, they actually hit. I still have lethal, though, right? Unless they have a parley, I guess. But this activates, like, buff them up. Puts way more pressure here. And I could potentially end the game. Mystic shot maybe? Oh, another one. Will this stop it? No, it's not enough. It's not enough. Oh, really, really nice game. We, we actually dropped pretty low though. Oh yeah, very close game. GG's, GG's. Alright, we are up against... Bard, Gnar, Sergio. So this is... Uh, kind of an overwhelmed Chimes deck, I guess. Uh, just not sure if they run anything weird in there. Uh, I can go with this and put early pressure, I guess, into a Dionna, maybe later into Pale to activate her challenger. But yeah, pass. Uh, this is really good to pick off their things, by the way. I can block this, it's whatever. It's just they could buff its HP a little bit, right? So it makes it difficult for us to kill it, maybe. But yeah. Uh, I could go this into Dionna, but then I can't play Pale Cascade, which might be important, right? So I'll do this first and see what they want to do. And I can save this to, like, synergize with this later on. So it's not, like, the awful, awful play. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to do it like this, actually. It's just Bone Club is kind of what I'm scared of. Bone Club is kind of scary. So I'm gonna force them into like playing their resources to protect it. Yeah, this is also. Uh, I don't want them to play Bone Club on an Overwhelm unit and then we have to... We can't even kill it, we'll have to like silence it or something, right? And that's not fun. Let's go with the big guy here. Put some challenger. The bard is a bit scary. But they kind of thinking about attacking with him. But it's not really that good because I can block him, damage him, then pull the on and kill him. Which is very bad for them. This is a good throw. We can buff things up here. Uh, put more uh, more challenger. And we set up 
A nice attack. Asmos. Alright, let's swing with everything. Pull this on the Diana. This goes here. And everything else goes face. Pushing 8 damage face. Do they want to block with the Asmos? They do. And we have a Pale Cascade to deal with this. Freeze. Or Fury of the North. So Diana dead. I could play the Diana Pale. Or I could save it. I think I want to save the Diana. Do I want to save a Diana? Do I need a Diana? Potentially. Potentially. I'll do this to kill the Asmos here. Is she leveling? No. If she was leveling, she could have actually killed here. Uh, no, not here. Just chill. Actually, maybe I should have saved the pale. Now thinking about it, I should have saved the pale most likely. Would have been a bit better. Uh, Alright, let's do it. It would have been better because I could have ac activated winding light. Now I can't do that anymore with a pale cascade, right? Well, it's okay. Kind of. They're setting up a white board here. Yeah, without a winding light play, it's gonna be difficult for us to, to do stuff here. Mm, maybe we can draw into something. That's something, thank you very much. Let's do this into a winding light. We got super lucky here, by the way. Oh yeah, we jam winding light, buff up everything. Diana is pushing a lot of damage. She is leveling. And she can pull something and kill it. Probably, probably pull this guy, right? Kill him. But the rest can kill these other weaklings. Alright. They could still have freezes, right? You will go here, go here, you here, just to maximize that overwhelm damage. Uh, and this should be lethal unless they have like freezes, harsh winds maybe or something. But yeah, nothing, nothing. GG's, GG's. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one. Take care and goodbye.